Hi guys, welcome back to Ahead in Time. So, uh, it wasn't actually the time thing up there that we got. We actually got that present. So, the time thing we've done before. I was pretty sure we had done it. We got uh, another hat. More hats, alright. Well, that um, pretty much takes care of that. Um, so, here's the thing. It says here um, that uh, I don't have the right hat on. That's what it says. Also, changed my skin back to something more green. So... Here's the thing, guys. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure where to get like an overview, but as far as I know, I think I've done all the new time rifts, except for like, I think there's like two more, but those are done in some other mode, um, which is highly unfortunate. Now, well, let's, uh, yeah, we don't need anything up there. All right, well, I guess we might as well start the, the next part. So, that's it for seal the SEAL mission area, and that's it for the new time rifts that you kind of get by default. And then, as far as I know, the rest of it's, like, over here. Uh, so it starts a new, uh, chapter of the game, kind of-ish. Uh, I was yelled at to go over here a bunch. Yeah, I was. Or maybe I wasn't. I don't see anything over here. Wait. As nothing here. I thought there was something over here. Or maybe it's over here. Spooky ghost though. Alright. Well, this starts the next chapter of the game, uh, kind of a thing, which is another thing that they added, which is contracts. Um, they're a little bit odd. So, I mean, I haven't talked much about the, the content of the game so the content of the game so far. The difficulties kind of spiked a little bit compared to what the game was before that, which is a little bit strange. Uh, I think the dev got off like uh, some acid and was playing like Dark Souls or something. Now I'm just joking, but uh, no, but like it, it was a little bit harder than the rest of the stuff, especially that last pink one. Like the thing is, remember that one where I like the last one where I, I kind of glitched out, but I had to like jump between two walls, alternating like this ability, like. That one, uh, you've never had an opportunity to practice that without, like, basically dying and falling. Which, it's usually, like, uh, like, I guess the staple of most platformers, especially, like, um, uh, kind of like, I guess, like, the Nintendo ones, especially. You get to practice it in, in situations where you don't die over and over again. Um, and that's the first time it's ever brought that kind of, like, wall-jumping mechanic where you have to alternate your ability kind of a thing. So, that's why it's, um... Probably a little bit questionable what he did. Like, he just all of a sudden, like, goes, like, ah, oh, that's a neat mechanic, and then kind of puts it in, but it's like, we've never had a chance to kind of practice it, so. Anyways, I don't know. But then, speaking of difficulty curve, uh, get ready. If you survive, that is. I've got this little map for you. You'll notice I've marked just one contract on it for now. You'll have to complete it before you unlock the rest. Checks and balances, you know. And be careful, kid. These aren't your average everyday contracts. These are advanced contracts. We wouldn't want you to die on the job, right? <laughs> All right, well, there's out of 111, and this is where it starts. I'm not sure how much I'm going to be doing of this, but we'll see. So, we start with Beat the Heat and what's Snatcher's tip? Don't worry about doing everyday task. Every task or contract at the same time, you can come back later and do them. I don't mind it really. So... And this is that beat the heat one where we turn off the faucets, but it's much hotter than usual, you cool yourself off. So basically it's like, uh, it's kind of more timed. You guys remember this one? It was like, like what, part five or some shit that we did. Look at mess. This is terrible. Someone turn on all faucets in Mafia Town. 
A faucet that control the town volcano. Was it you, child? No? Mafia think he saw a little girl turn on all faucets. Little hat kid, can you save Mafia town by turning off all faucets? If you close all, maybe water start flowing again. Now what's weird is it actually isn't telling me this time what the objective is. Uh, the bonuses. Because I can tell you what the bonuses are, because I already know them. It's don't cool off more than twice, and don't ever get too hot, which is, uh, what happens when you, uh... Uh, what, what, basically, uh, here, I'm gonna show you the mechanics. So, it doesn't actually give you a timer, but you can see my screen is, like, turning a little bit more red. You go in here, you cool off. That's it. That's just what happens with this level. It's really weird. So you're supposed to go, like, go back to the water, and like, I just, I, I, I'm not, I don't really care about the optionals, like, I really don't. Because these are like, really kind of oddly difficult as it is, so... Like I said, I, I, I can do these, but... Um, I don't know, it, uh, we'll see if they get a little bit more interesting. Because, uh, like, if it's just like a repeat with some weird mechanics like this, uh, I'm not sure how much I want to be doing of this. As you can see, we're capping the water, because that's uh, how we roll. Well. Now here's a problem, this one's like all the way out here. Oh shit, there's like no water around. Now we have to go find water, so I guess I'll go this way. So we're about to start taking damage, I can guarantee you that. There we go, we got another one. Probably I should be using my, uh, my abilities to, uh... Make this better, like sprinting. Alright. Alright, so the last one's over there, right? I don't know, there's one over here. I guess we'll go get that. I never got that yarn, but I don't really care. Fuck, stop jumping onto that. Fuck, Nugget. Alright, thanks. Hey, if I turn into ice, that mean, does that mean, uh... We don't take damage anymore? Because we're ice? Logistically speaking, no, I'm just joking. I fucking hate people like that. So, I'm not gonna do that. Well, oh shit. What? No, no, no. What? She spends time doing that. Okay, we need to go to water though before we, uh... Because it's not over yet. Alright, so now we just need to go to the cannon. Well, do it on first try, I guess. You did it. No, okay. No, yeah, well, we don't really care. And now they're purple or some shit. So there's like 111 of these or some some kind of crap like that. So there you can see the bonuses. Uh, don't cool down more than two gems. Uh. 
personally, I don't really care about the bonuses, um, because a lot of them get kind of bullshitty, um, but, you know, whatever. Like I said, uh, you know, what do you want, kid? I'm rereading my favorite part of this book. What's this? Snatcher's hit list. Kill five mafia without getting punched. Oh, it's the same one. Well done, kiddo. You can light a candle. I'm real impressed. You can complete these contracts in any act. Some acts might be more suitable than others. So what are you waiting for? Alright. You ready to die? Ready to die more. So that's like a bonus on top of that. Oh good, it's uh, locked behind uh, more things, so... So you're back from outer space. Uh, reach the timepiece. Mafia saw the spaceship. What's his tip? Alright, I guess we'll see what this is. Alright, as it is, I'm not getting a whole, a whole lot of choices to move around this map, so we'll, we'll see. Does that mean when they saw the spaceship? They do not care. It's a little bit leggy here, but it's okay. Uh, is that doable? Sure. What the fuck? Am I missing out on something? <laughs> what? Um. Oh, okay. There we go. I I don't know why it feel felt like so difficult. Oh, okay, we get more of this shit then. Okay, I somehow went between the two balloons. Oh, and those are going over there. Dude, the perspective of this is so fucked up right now. For me. Fuck. Uh, you're gonna watch me be bad for a little bit, honestly. Because, like, these are... I'm doing this blind. Like, these are new to me. And these are, like... It has some very strange difficulty curves as well. And as you can see, not really much room for healing either. What the hell? Oh, you tripped me. What an asshole. See, when I look over here, it gets really laggy. Well, not really laggy, but... And I'm sure I'm sure there's people who played this game at like fucking 10 FPS or some shit, so. Okay, well we did it that time. Guess we'll kill the guy that's on the platform here, because he's fucking annoying. Killed five mafia with that oh, that's the other one. Let's go with this place, though. Huh. Fuck. Oh. 
Fucking hell. Okay, good. No, why? Dude, what the fuck? Uh. Oh my god. Dude, the timing window on that. I don't know why it's so hard, but it fucking is. Well. You're lost. Time to go back to XCOM. These UFOs are making me all nostalgic now. Well. You get kind of an idea of what they want you to do in this now. Alright, ten times a charm. Okay, we're gonna have to do it like when it's going up. Oh my god, god dude, what the fuck? I hate this shit now. Alright. I can't figure this out. Oh my god. I'm like I'm already in the middle of fucking jumping. Like Dude, the perspective on this place sucks ass. I fucking hate this fucking shit. I can't tell. What? What's this shit? I just clicked and... No one around is around to help. Is the game mocking me? Guys, I feel like I'm being mocked right now. Alright. Alright, I actually don't need- I actually don't want this. Should I make Death Wish a bit easier for you? No. I think this is their new thing called, like, Easy Mode. What would it do to make it easier for me, though? The questions we ask. See now, normally I would just say fuck this mission. Let's go. Let's go do something else. You know, it's a little bit more fun. But you know, we we can't do that because um, everything's uh, behind a locked thing. So uh, yeah, um, we gotta just keep bashing your head at this thing. I mean, I've gotten really good at that jump, so you know, that's something. Dude, it's... I, I don't know why the cannonballs there fuck me up so much, though. Like, I'm in the middle of fucking jumping. Like, I, I actually fucking hate my life. Yeah, I didn't do it. Oh my god, I fucking did it. Yeah, I'm not talking to any of you. And it gets like really laggy to here. Nice fucking game! God damn it. Dude, it's it's the worst part is it's this fucking level, because it's for some reason on my PC. My PC fucking hates it. Alright, let's go time this fucking garbage. Good shit. I'm having a grand old time. I mean like fucking no FPS on this, like fuck. Alright, fucking piece of shit. Let me go lower the graphics settings to me. This is fucking doable. Because for some reason this place, uh... Very high quality. Alright, we're going to high performance, guys. We're going to high performance, lads.
I swear to God, it's always been this place that's been a problem. Hey, look, no rain effects anymore. And now it's smooth as a fucking, uh, I don't know. And, but here's a problem. I couldn't actually see a shadow on here, so I thought he was, like, over here somewhere. So, uh, this is, this is the true... They actually removed the shadows. Oh, wait, no, it shows up over there. Alright, maybe we've, uh, maybe we've turned it down a little bit too much, because I use those shadows for my, um, death perception purposes. So, um... How do you... Oh, of course, you press buttons. Okay, let's put shadow quality to very high. Because we want the best shadow quality. You go fuck yourself. Dude, he's gonna rub it in. Maybe you should just restart because we're so close to the beginning. Whatever. Oh, okay, I'm just gonna restart this now. Slipping out of your contract that easily. What's going on? Why is he not, like you're not slipping out of it that easily? Beep. See, look, now he's over there. He wasn't even fucking close that time. God damn it. This guy's an asshole. Don't those shadows look brilliant, guys? Nothing but the best shadow quality for you guys. Okay, what what is it about that jump that I can't do? I don't know, but I have problems, right? All right, we all love a bit of timing bullshittery. What's the deal with that over there? I don't know. Oh shit! Oh, it puts me back here! Alright, we lost. Yeah, we can't do it that fast. Alright, I I don't know, dude, I'm just annoyed, dude. This this shit's like I kinda knew this was coming too. Uh, should we try peace and tranquility? No, I, I actually don't. I don't really care. It, it's just the thing is though about this, and I knew I knew it was coming too, and I knew I probably wouldn't want to do it. You know, it's like I get it, they want to add like a more of like a uh, difficulty thing, because uh, the game is relatively easy. Because uh, I remember I got through it with like not much in terms of uh, difficulty, right? Um, and I, I and I'm not that like for me playing 3D platformers, it's like not exactly my element. Like uh, I don't play a lot of 3D platformers, so. Uh, yeah, like, it's just, it was just a nice, like, easy experience, right? I don't know where the rest of the four are. I don't know, if there's some other ones that I don't know of, then you guys can tell me, but I don't, I, don't, I think that's, I, as far as I know, that's it. Unless everything has an extra one somewhere. No, it doesn't look like it to me. Because I, I, would, I would prefer to leave out off at that, you know, because that's why I kind of like doing this game, because it was just a nice, you know... It was, just a, it was just a pleasant experience that I got through with relatively... Whoa, what? Dude, what? Really? Okay. Uh, I never saw it before. Oh, it doesn't do that. It's just the hamburger that does that. It was just a, it was a pleasant experience I got through in like a relatively short amount of time. Um, you know, I, I did like 20 parts-ish. Well, 30 now, but... Um, you know, it, it was just a pleasant experience and I didn't have to really... Uh, it grind at things that much, and that's why I liked it. Like, I'm, I'm not a big fan of just, like, grinding through things necessarily, over and over again. It's uh, kind of the reason I didn't get into, like, you've never seen me do, like, Cuphead or anything. I've tried Cuphead. Uh, but, like, it's just, it was a really grindy game, and I didn't, uh... It's just not my thing. Like, I, I, I don't blame you if you like that thing. Uh, that's, that's completely fine. But, uh, I, I don't know, I like, I like progression. 
kind of thing. But it doesn't mean I don't like a challenge. But, you know, I, I kind of like thinking challenge. That's why you see like a lot of things like XCOM and um, some other bullshit on my channel. But, you know, this starts to get a little bit, uh, a little bit too much for me. Because I, I'd have to, like, get really good or something. And, and uh, yeah. I know someone's out there is going to be really pissed <laughs> that I fucking gave up on it, but, you know, I, I, I'm i I'm not into it, so. Um, that's for the rest of it. Like, I guess we're just going to talk for a bit. Um, Seal the Deal, the, at least the new place, was actually pretty good. Um, you know, I'm glad they made a new level. Uh, it was a little bit short. Uh, that's the one thing I will say. Um, it could have been a bit longer. Because um, it was, what, three levels? That's it? And then, well, then, then there was a, a the time the time thing, uh, the time rift. Um, which is pretty difficult. And once again, I'm gonna iterate again that I found it really odd that they were making me do mechanics that they didn't even give me a chance to try out, like, without the penalty of death. Because, like I said, that's what, if you've looked at any, like, other 3D platformer, that's typically what they make you do. If you're having to wall hop in between things and, like, uh, go between, like, this mode, you know. Um, they would give you a chance somewhere else to do something very similar to it, you know. So, that's 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 my whole complaint about that. Which is, it's just kind of out of the blue. And I was reading, like, the, there's, like, a Steam forums for it, and I think the reviews and stuff. And this is basically the same complaints that other people had about it, which is, like, you know, it's really weird kind of progression. Although the local co-op is uh, always appreciated, but um, I don't have a controller, so I can't uh, try that. Uh, I, I haven't tried that out, um, because I don't have a friend that's willing to play this with me that isn't uh, halfway across the world, so, you know. Uh, feels bad, man. Keep moving around too much. I mean, my roommate, I'm sure, uh, would be into it, but you don't want to hear him. He's like really Polish and racist. It's a fucking great guy. Uh, <laughs> and, um... Yeah, so, yeah, a little bit short on the content that I've actually would have wanted to play. Um, although, I did get an extra, like, five parts out of this game, I guess. Uh, but, yeah, no, I, I just have, I don't really have any interest in those contracts. But I know what they're here for. I know they're here for the kind of person that would enjoy playing those same missions again, but with, like, very difficult platforming kind of thing. But, um... I'm just, I'm just not good enough for that, so, uh, you know. I, I, I don't feel like there's, like, really a medium, the, the closest they ever got to a medium difficulty was some of those time rifts before that. Um, that was the closest thing that they did, it, it, was either, it either was too easy or too hard. But, the, 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 basically the medium part of the game was very short, I'd say, you know. Um, so it's just what, it is what it is, so. Uh, well, anyways, guys, um. I guess back to some more XCOM, uh, which is what I was doing before. I kind of took a break for this, so. Uh, enjoyable experience, it was nice. Uh, so thanks a lot for tuning in, and uh, if they do some more for this game, or I don't know, maybe there's something I missed out on, uh, we'll do that, but uh, we'll revisit it ahead in time again. But, um, you know, uh, with that being said, I think, uh, I think we're good. I think those contracts are too annoying for me. So, uh, now here's a weird thing. Uh, so if I go back to Hub World before we quit the ent entire thing. So when we go back here, I'm 80% complete, but it says I've completed two contracts. Does this mean that the contracts are because, like, 20% of the game incomplete? I, I'm guessing it, it's referring to the contracts, and that's a part of the percentage. Because I didn't see enough content, or at least I didn't read about enough content to warrant that being... It's it's weird. But anyways, uh, delete this one. Nice. Uh, but yeah, so, I didn't see enough content to warrant it, so... Um, they didn't say they I, they, I, they, I guess it's the contract stuff, that's the last 20%, so. Anyways, thank, thank you very much, and uh, I guess we'll, uh, we'll be good. Fuck, open my browser. Fuck, now it's awkward. Alright, bye.